not an independent member of parliament, Temba Mliso, says the Central Intelligence Organization, CIO District Intelligence Officer, has told him that President Emerson Nangagwa is not the one running the country's affairs. Mliso says the CIO officer, which he only identified as Nieta, told him that the problem today is that most political decisions are being done by Auxilia Mnangagwa and her son Emerson Mnangagwa Jr. and not President Mnangagwa, as should be the case. However, he told me that the problem today is that most political decisions are made by the First Lady and Junior. For example, he predicted accurately that Muswere and Wajgajina would return as winners because they are close to Junior and have some mutual deals with him, respectively, he says. He asked that Neta further told him that CIO officers are now living in poverty. Neta actually informed me about the financing of FAZ, which has seen some of them getting as much as $10,000 to rig the primary elections, while the CIO officers get 200 US dollars plus some other TGSs. All the final financial details I have about the CIO, he told me. Moliswa, however, said it is disheartening that Neta went on to sell him out. It's unfortunate when people who you converse with in trust turn on you and sell out. I always say our conversations have to be private, but one of my CIO sources, DIO Neta, has decided to be a smart aleck. I went to school with Neta, and he was my senior, but he has gone rogue. Melissa says, as a CIO operative, he confided in me until he thought to be clever for nothing. Recently, I met with Neta at the airport, and we spoke as usual. He invited a lady he was with, and we spoke for a long time in the understanding that this was as before. He confided in me how I should be wary about the first lady and junior because they don't like me and have repeatedly influenced ED against me. According to him, the first lady has assumed too much political authority over ED and not many could go against her by telling ED the truth. Neta also urged me to speak out about the poor working conditions for the CIO since ED's emergence as president and said he is still wearing suits he bought when Mugabe was president. He was allegedly also removed from being part of ED's protection unit due to tribalism.